Hello, my students. How are you? I hope you are doing well. In this lesson, we will listen for specific information and understand and use simple correction code for proofreading. Look at your course book page 27. Top tip checking for errors. When you have finished a piece of writing, always take time to proofread and edit it for errors in grammar and spelling. Proofreading means looking for errors, editing means correcting the errors. Look at your workbook page 24, activity 2. Read the simple correction code below. This activity is an exercise in simple proofreading and editing. Look at the suggested correction code for any future proofreading and editing work. Write the letters related to each type of error clearly. GR means grammar error. VOC, word, wrong word. SP, spelling error. WO, wrong word order. Now, read this teenager's email to a problem page auntie from a student worried about her acne. Read the email line by line. Correct the student's mistakes using the correction code above by writing the correct code above the mistake. There are two mistakes of each type. Then write the email out again in your exercise book in the corrected version. Now, stop this video and take your time. Do this task on your own. Now, check your proofreading. In line one, the word support, it's a wrong word. The right word is suffer. In line two, there is a wrong word, it's unbeautiful. The right word is ugly. And also the word look on, it's a grammar error. It should be look in. In line three, there is a grammar error, doesn't. It must be don't. In line four, there is spelling error. It's birthday. The right spelling is B I R T H D A Y. And also the word friends should be F R I E N D S. And there is a wrong word order. Good luck. It should be look good. I can. It's a wrong word order. It should be can I. Look at your workbook page 24, activity 3. Read. Auntie's reply to Lucy's email. Choose the most suitable word from each group of words in bold and circle it. Read the whole letter before you start choosing the words in order to get the sense of it. Now stop the video and read this letter. What is it? It's a swan. The baby swan is called swan duckling. Disappear patient. Treat healthy diet. 
exercises. Squeezing spots. Now listen to the recording and check your answers. Listening 2.5.1 Have you ever heard the story of the ugly duckling? The bird that was unhappy because it thought it was so ugly. But it grew up into a beautiful swan. Well, the same will happen with you. Your acne will not last forever. One day it will disappear. It's hard to be patient, I know. You can't cure acne, but you can treat it. You can buy special creams to help, but there are other things you can do too. Look after your health in the weeks before your party. Drink lots of water and eat a healthy diet. Take plenty of exercise and always have a shower afterwards. Keep your skin clean and don't squeeze your spots. Above all, get plenty of sleep because your body needs rest. Now check your answers. Number one, swan. Two, disappear. Three, patient. Four, treat. Five, diet. Six, exercise. Seven, spots. Eight, sleep. With my best wishes, I am Adil Gabriel Mikhail. Goodbye and good luck.